Hey guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to download and install OBS. So we're going to jump right in. But first guys, if you want, you can go down on this video in the comment section and click on the first comment that I pinned. This will bring you to my Fiverr. And here as you can see on my Fiverr, you can get a logo or a banner or both for your YouTube channel if you want. But now back to the video. Now I'm just going to go ahead and type OBS here. And then you will see that it's the first site here, Open Broadcast Software from the OBSproject.com. Just click the first one here. Then as you can see here, we have three options. We have Windows, Mac, and also Linux here. Now I'm on Windows, so I'm obviously going to choose Windows here. And as you can see in the top right corner here, it's going to start downloading. And once it's done here, you can do two things. You can do show in folder, but you can also just open it immediately if it's a .x or so a setup. So I'm just going to open it immediately here. And now here as you can see, the setup will pop up. So you can do next. Now here you can also do next. And then here, this is pretty important. You can leave it like this. That's what I advise you to do. But you can also browse where you want it to be installed. But I definitely advise you to just keep it like... Well, OBS wants you to install it. So let me just click install. Okay, so there we go. We're just going to leave launch OBS Studio checked here. I'm going to do finish. Now, if you're actually using OBS for the first time, you can actually have a window like this. That will show up. So here, as you can see, it says optimize for streaming. Recording is secondary or optimize for just recording. I will not be streaming. You can also only use the virtual camera if you want. But in my case, I always do recordings. I never stream. So I just selected the second one. But if you're, for example, going to stream, you're going to, of course, choose the first one. And then you can click next. And then there's also another window that could be there. In which it shows you the revolution. Now, I have a 920 by 1080 screen. So that's the resolution. It's a 24 inch screen and FPS. You can actually click on the FPS and go down and click on 60 because I definitely advise you to go for 60. If your computer is really slow, you might consider 30, but I will just in most cases just go for 60. And then you can click next again. And that's basically it. You can go ahead and do a profile and do settings for OBS. Set up your desktop audio, your microphone. Now, if you want help with that, I actually have three types of videos right here. The first one is just an OBS video on how to set it up. The best settings that I consider for recording. Then in case you have a low end PC, I also have a video on how to get get the best settings for low-end PCs on OBS and I actually uploaded most recently a video on how to actually set up your microphone and how to get a very professional sounding microphone in OBS itself without any other software. You can just do that within OBS itself. So if you want to check these videos out next, definitely consider you there up here in the corner. But in any case, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Hope it helped, of course. Please leave a like, it would be really nice. Subscribe to also be really nice and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.